I reached out to the owners of Classic Auto Spot to give them the opportunity to buy Squeege Co. for $500,000. Classic Auto Spot does high-end detailing. And to let them know that I was serious, I had our producers explain to them that they were like dragons on a new reality show. You've seen the disgusting Squeegee kids on the street? Yes, sir. I've, I've seen, maybe not disgusting, but I've seen... Disgusting is a harsh way to put it, but... Yes. So I have a bunch of disgusting squeegee kids working for me, and I'm making all the money basically myself. Before I even make any offer, I'd have to see your numbers. That's the one. Any, any business runs... But this is not numbers, this is just a... a <laughs> this is just a picture that you pulled off of Google. I don't know anyone in their right mind that's going to be starting a business that don't have an idea what it's going to cost to run that business on a day-to-day -day basis. And something realistic and well, tangible for us to be able to... zero dollars an hour, so I mean, if you tally that up... Okay, I don't... We've what making, did you... We've been making stupid money. Okay, what did you make last year, in 2012? What were your problems? The company's only been running for about a week now. You've invested zero, so how could you have made any profits? Because oh, I have a bunch of idiots working for free. So you're organizing them, but you're not paying them, so they're... Right, I'm not paying them, I'm paying them jack shit. They're losing, they would have been making more doing it on their own, and right, approaching people's cars. but they're, but they're cars. retards. Apparently they're not retards because by doing it on their own and collecting the money on their own terms, right. they'd be making... Once you buy the company, you can run it how you want it. I mean, If I, we paid them a penny, we'd be paying them anything. And that's none of my concern once you buy the business. I remember when I first started my company and... Well, not everyone has daddy's money to throw around now. Well, I don't have the daddy's money to throw around either, right? Where did you get it then? To the bank. Okay, so your dad's a bank teller. What does that have to do with money? Okay, and that 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 um, that be, being not being relevant because my dad's not a bank teller for one. You need a business plan, a concrete business plan. You need, you know, a projection of your blah, sales. Blah, you need. Blah. I wasn't listening to any of that. To tell you the truth, sorry. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I don't believe that we're okay. interested at the time. Like, I have a business to run. And those pieces of shit just passed on the deal of a lifetime.